Skip Elaine Robson alongside third Candice Newkirk, second Malaysia Johnson, and lead Sherry Logan have won the Women's Curling Club replay event. The team only lost one game the whole event to Team Robin Despins on Saturday afternoon, and with the rematch in the final, it was Team Robson who came out on top. Team Robson made their home club, the Moose Jaw Ford Curling Center, very proud as they represented Saskatchewan at the Everest Curling Club Championships, held November 28th to December 4th in Ottawa, Ontario. The team finished fifth in their pool with a 2-4 record. Congratulations to Team Grinham on winning the Men's Curling Club replay event that took place at the Twin Rivers Curling Club from October 29th to November 1st. The team consists of Skip Dean Grinham, third Mike Steckler, second Mark Steckler, and lead Jack Brower. They curl out of the Sutherland Curling Club in Saskatoon. They defeated Team Shane Volman in the final. Team Grinham represented Saskatchewan at the Everest Curling Club Championships held November 28th to December 4th in Ottawa, Ontario where they won the national silver medal. Team Grinham comprised of Skip Dean Grinham, third Sherry Just, second Cole Tenenchuk, and lead Allison Ingram claimed the green jackets at the Prince Albert Golf and Curling Club on October 17, 2021. After losing the A event final to Team Sean Joyce, then losing the B event semi-final to Team Brad Bibby, they clinched their playoff spot in a rematch against Team Bibby in the C event final. In their 10th game of the weekend, Team Grenham defeated Team Ben Gamble 6-3 and booked their ticket to the Canadian Mixed Curling Championships in Canmore, Alberta, November 7th to 14th. They finished second in their pool with a 6-2 record, and in the championship pool, they finished seventh with a 5-5 record. Team Clyder also booked their ticket to the 2021 New Holland World Junior Qualifier in Saskatoon. After a perfect round robin record, Team Clyder faced Team Emily Hopstein in the final and came out with a 6-5 win. The team is comprised of Skip Madison Clyder, third Kaya Kennedy, second Kelsey Kennedy, lead Mary Angle, and coaches Dean Clyder and Brad Kennedy. The team finished fourth in their pool with a 2-3 record. Team Bernoth battled their way through the B side of the Junior Men's Provincials in Tisdale, Saskatchewan and claimed the championship in the final against Team Logan Ede. The team is comprised of Skip Damon Bernoth, third Bryden Tessier, second David Baum, lead Jack Reed and coach Darren Cam. They curl out of the Sutherland Curling Club in Saskatoon. Team Bernoth advanced to the 2021 New Holland World Junior Qualifier in Saskatoon where they lost out in the semi-final against Team Nova Scotia. The Humboldt Curling Club hosted the 2021 U18 Men's and Women's Open Provincial Championships on December 27th to December 30th. Congratulations to Team Taylor on capturing their first green jacket in Humboldt, Saskatchewan. Their 5-1 round-robin record secured them a spot in the first provincial final of the event. They defeated Team Kessel 6-5 and booked their ticket to the national event. The team consists of Skip Savannah Taylor, 3rd Annika Steckler, 2nd Ava Boussole, lead Katie Kennedy, alternate Leah Boussole and coach Brian Steckler. The team curls out of the Nutana Curling Club in Saskatoon. After losing the first provincial final, Team Kessel had a quick turnaround before they played the second provincial final against Team Kesslerling. They defeated Team Kesslerling 7-4 and secured their spot as Team Saskatchewan 2. The teams will represent Saskatchewan at the 2022 Canadian U18 Championships in Oakville, Ontario in May of 2022. Congratulations to Skip Elizabeth Kessel, 3rd Tessa Silversides, 2nd Maya Silversides, lead Hannah Rugg, and coach Garnet Zumak. Team Matthew Druitts also captured their first provincial championship win. The team consists of Skip Matthew Druitts, 3rd Michael Hom, 2nd Carter Parenteau, lead Jared Tessier, and coach Dale Newfield. The team curls out of the Sutherland Curling Club in Saskatoon. 
Team Druids went undefeated through the event and will represent Saskatchewan in Oakville, Ontario in May of 2022. Team Heistead won the second men's provincial final in Humboldt to book their ticket to Oakville as well. Team Heistead battled their way through the 3-4 game and secured two straight wins on Championship Sunday of the event. The team consists of Skip Braden Heistead, third Logan Swicky, second Andy Lloyd, lead Ryder Helmecki, and coach Dustin Mickish. The team curls out of the Highland Curling Club in Regina. Clean. Yes, 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 yes. Stephanie, I think it was, indicating it was a nice throw. Good sportsmanship there, and Kenny Barker with the open hit. Runs Chelsea Carey out of rocks, and she will pick up the victory here in the Saskatchewan <laughs> Championship Final. They will be going to Thunder Bay to represent Saskatchewan at the Scott Tournament of Hearts. Penny Barker picked up her second trip to the Scotties in 2022. The team from the Moose Jaw Ford Curling Centre won their right to represent Team Saskatchewan at the 2022 Scotties Tournament of Hearts this past January in Thunder Bay. The team finished round-robin play with a 4-4 record and just missed qualifying for playoffs. Congratulations to Skip Penny Barker, third Christy Gamble, second Jenna Angie, lead Danielle Szynski and coach Mark Lang. After five great days in Whitewood, Saskatchewan, Team Flash from the Nutana Curling Club walked away with the Green Jackets and their ticket to the 2022 Tim Hortons Briar in March. Congratulations to Skip Colton Flash, third Catlin Schneider, second Kevin Marsh, lead Dan Marsh, and coach Jamie Schneider. The tricky part of this one actually is, is going to be making sure you make contact with both stones. If you just come straight into it and you heard him say you could just go dead into the one and, and still get shot rock, he comes and across, but Colton it's going to be Flash is going to the bronze. Qualifying for playoffs through the C event, they battled their way through the playoffs, defeating Matt Dunstone in the final. Yeah, it's, it's, it's exciting. Um, different feeling than ever before, but I mean, every every provincial championship or whatever championship is always very important. They're all special in their own way, but yeah, definitely playing skip is new, and then playing with three awesome friends is, is also very, very enjoyable. Their run at the Briar was nothing short of remarkable. With the 6-2 round robin record finishing third in their pool, they held their own through playoffs and came up against a strong Team Gushu in the 3-4 game. Team Shaylin Kitts and Sam Wills captured the green jacket in Aberdeen at the 2022 Mixed Doubles Provincials. They came out of the B event and rattled off three straight wins on Sunday to capture the championship. Mixed doubles is a grind, so it's just, it's always good to yeah. be on top. Yeah, this whole weekend was a grind, like we always felt like we could be playing better and that I think we saved our best game for the finals, so mm -hmm. it feels fantastic. Congratulations to Shaylin Kitts and Sam Wells. Congratulations Team Clyder on their second provincial win this season. The girls won the event in an extra end win against Team Kessel. Let's see if Madison Clyder is going to have to throw her last rock to win this championship. Let's see if Elizabeth Kessel has one more magical shot up her sleeve. That's right. This one's curling a little bit early on her. She's got to get by the one at the top of the forefoot that uh, was just thrown. I think it's just going to over curl. She's going to touch that one at the top forefoot and will not have the weight she needs. Madison Clyder not going to have to throw her final stone. She will pick up this Saskatchewan championship. I feel like we just like took it one shot at a time every game and like just had so much belief in each other and 
put our like hearts out every single game, I feel like. The team consists of Skip Madison Kleider, third Kaya Kennedy, second Brianna Kish, lead Hannah Johnson, and coach Dean Kleider. The team represented Saskatchewan at the 2022 Canadian Junior Curling Championships in Stratford, Ontario. They finished the week with a 5-3 record, just falling short of playoffs. Team Bernoth secured their second green jacket of the season on March 27, 2022 in Martinsville, Saskatchewan. Easy. Yep. No. Go the other way, yep. No. Yes. Close, yep. 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 Oh. Hard. Makes the hit, catches the second, will remove it from play. He picks up a single point. That gives Damon Bernath an 11-4 lead, and indeed, the gloves come off, and we have the handshakes. Damon Bernath will be the Saskatchewan Junior Men's Curling Champion. The team consists of Skip Damon Bernath, third Bryden Tessier, second David Baum, lead Jack Reed, and coach Darren Cam. It's amazing, it's a dream come true. At the beginning of the year, we set out a goal to win this event, and the one in October was another one that we definitely had a goal set on, but we were such a new team, we, we didn't know what to expect, but this was the main goal for the season, and so to accomplish that is just beyond a dream, it's amazing. They wore the green jacket in Stratford, Ontario, and went seven and one through round robin, and had a bye to the semi-final. After a tough loss to Team Ontario in the semi-final, the team bounced back with an 11-5 victory over Manitoba to capture the bronze medal. Team Pimedli also represented Team Saskatchewan 2 at the 2022 Canadian Junior Curling Championships in Stratford, Ontario. Saskatchewan qualified for another spot based on their performance at previous national events. They finished round robin play at the national event with a 5-3 record, fourth in their pool and just short of playoffs. Congratulations to Skip Nathan Pimedli, third Braden Fleischacker, second Jaden Bindig, lead Ethan Desolais, and coach Vern Anderson from the Nutana Curling Club. On March 6, 2022, Team Sherry Anderson captured their sixth consecutive senior provincial title. The team went undefeated through round robin play and booked their ticket to the final. They faced a tough team Tracy Strifle in the final, but ultimately came out with a 6-3 victory. The team consists of Skip Sherry Anderson, third Patty Hersicorn, second Brenda Gordson, and lead Anita Silvernagel. The team will represent Saskatchewan at the Everest Canadian Senior Curling Championships in November of 2022. Team Anderson also captured their fourth consecutive Canadian Senior Championship at the 2021 Everest Canadian Seniors Curling Championships. The Senior Men's Provincials took place in Aberdeen, Saskatchewan at the beginning of March. Defending champions, Team Daryl McKee, faced Team Randy Bryden in the A-Event Final, with Team McKee taking the 6-5 win and securing himself a spot in the 1-2 game. Team Bryden went on to win the B event and earned their spot against Team McKee in the 1-2 game. When the teams met for the second time of the event, it was Team McKee who took the win in a 9-2 victory. Randy Bryden and his team from Regina battled their way to the championship final on Monday morning, where they faced Team McKee for the third time. The third time was the charm for Team Randy Bryden as they captured the championship in a 7-3 victory. The team consists of Skip Randy Bryden, third Troy Robinson, second Russ Bryden, and lead Chris Seminchuk. The 2022 Everest Canadian Seniors will be held in Nova Scotia in 2022. Congratulations to lead TJ Hakert, second Chris Hakert, third Kelly Schaefer, and skip Sean Meacham. From the Swift Current Curling Club, Team Meacham ran the table at Provincials, qualifying through the A event, and secured their spot at Nationals with two solid wins in the playoffs. The team will represent Saskatchewan at the 2022 Canadian Mixed Curling Championships, November 6th to 12th at the Prince Albert Golf and Curling Centre in Saskatchewan.
Team Rebecca Ride finished first in their pool with a 3-1 record and kept the momentum going through playoffs and defeated Team McMillan in the final and booked their ticket to the national championships. They will also represent Saskatchewan at the West Edmonton Mall Ice Palace in November. The team consists of Skip Rebecca Ride, 3rd Ellen Redlick, 2nd Lee Dick, and lead Amanda Torrance. Team Tenenchuk lost their first two games of the event and managed to rattle off eight straight wins to claim the championship. This team will represent Saskatchewan at the national event being held in the West Edmonton Mall Ice Palace on November 20th to 26th, 2022. Congratulations to Skip Cole Tenenchuk, 3rd Brennan Schilly, 2nd Brad Woodchick, and lead Chad McKenzie. Congratulations to the University of Regina Cougars on winning the gold medal at the 2022 Canada West Curling Championships. After the three women's teams were in a three-way tie, the championship was determined by the last stone draws. The Cougars sure made the province proud when they captured the title for the first time ever. The team consists of Skip Crystal Inglot, third Taylor Stremick, second Chantal Hogue, lead Kyla Thies, alternate Kelsey Deptuck, and coach Tom Hammond. They were set to advance to the 2022 U-Sport National Curling Championships in Sudbury, Ontario from March 15th to 19th, 2022, but was cancelled due to the coronavirus pandemic. Congratulations to all of our champions on such a great season. Thank you to all of our sponsors. Without your support, we wouldn't have had such a successful curling season.